Days before officially beginning their WAC membership, Incarnate Word has pulled a U-turn and elected to stick with the Southland. The San Antonio School is a private Catholic with 8,000 enrollment, $145 million endowment. They're ranked number 263 by U.S. News, and their $18.4 million athletic budget is first in the Southland. Incarnate Word started football in 2009. They moved up to FCS in 2013. They qualified for the FCS playoffs in 2018 and 2021. They're the defending Southland champions. Their $4.7 million football budget is first in the Southland, and they have a three-year rolling football tents average pre-COVID of roughly 3,900. They play in the Gale and Tom Benson Stadium, which opened in 2008 with a 6,000 capacity. Incarnate Word made three appearances in the Division II tournament in the 2000s. They moved up to Division I in 2013. Their $1.3 million men's basketball budget would rank third in the Southland. Their three-year rolling attendance average pre-COVID was roughly 650, and their five-year Ken Palm is 346. They play in the McDermott Center, which opened in 89 with a 2,000 capacity. Incarnate Word announced their move to the WAC in November, and seven months later here in June, they announced that they're staying in the Southland. In 12 months, the WAC will be at 11 schools. Five of them play football. Dixie State, who will become Utah Tech on July 1st. Southern Utah, Abilene Christian. Tarleton State, Stephen F. Austin. And then UTRGV will be starting football in 2025. The five non-football schools of the WAC are Seattle, Cal Baptist, Grand Canyon, Utah Valley, and UTA. The 10-member Southland has eight who play football. SLU, Nickel State. Northwestern State, McNeese State, Houston Baptist, Texas A&M Commerce, Lamar, who returns in 2023, and Incarnate Word, who will be playing Southland football this fall. Texas A&M Corpus Christi and UNO are non-football members, although UNO is exploring adding football. Here are the institutional profiles of the Southland. Incarnate Word's $145 million endowment leads the whole league. Here are the Southland athletic budgets after you isolate football. Incarnate Word would lead the Southland, followed by Lamar, Houston Baptist, Texas A&M Corpus Christi, and Texas A&M Commerce. Interestingly, the Louisiana Five would make up the bottom half. Here are the football budgets of the Southland. Incarnate Word is in first, followed by Houston Baptist, Lamar, SLU, and McNeese State. These are the Southland's men's basketball budgets. Texas A&M Corpus Christi is in first, Lamar is in second, Incarnate Word is in third, and McNeese State is in fourth. Here is the travel time that Google came up with if you were to hypothetically travel from each campus to every other campus in the league, although I heard I-10 has a lot more traffic than Google gives it credit for. And here are the football stadiums of the Southland. I'm making the assumption that if UNO adds football, they will be playing at Tad Gormley Stadium.